हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम यू अगेन टू योर चैनल शुभश्री मैम आप सबको टाइटल देख के ही मालूम पड़ गया कि व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डू यस यू आर राइट वी विल डू द सम बेस्ड ऑन डिवीजन एल्गोरिदम डिवीजन एल्गोरिदम इज जस्ट अ फॉर्मूला दैट बाय व्हिच यूजिंग दिस फॉर्मूला यू कैन फाइंड आउट डिविडेंट वेन द क्वेश्चन इज गिवेन डिविजन इज गिवेन रिमाइंडर इज गिवेन देन यू कैन फाइंड आउट डिविडेंट or you can find out question when the dividend divisor and the remainder is given you can find out the question but children feel difficulties in solving these types of sums so this is the result of today's video okay so learn properly listen properly and see how you will find out dividend how you will find out quotient all these things okay so first you know you see that this is division algorithm what is division algorithm if the question is what is division algorithm what you will say you will write division algorithm it means dividend equals to divisor multiplied by quotient plus remainder this is division algorithm you have to write all this dividend equals to means divi by division algorithm we can find the dividend that is when we multiply divisor and quotient and we do plus the remainder then we can find out the dividend this is division algorithm base okay uh, now the question comes suppose uh these three is given and you, it is said that find the dividend so easily you can find out sometime it happens uh dividend divisor is given and remainder is given and saying what is the question this time the students get confused and they do mistake so this type of sum also we will do today first we were doing the we will do the normal one that divisor is given quotient is given remainder is given how to find out the dividend so let us start chalo der nahi karte jaldi jaldi shuru kar dete hain to pehle hum dividend wala sum karenge dividend kaise find out karte hain jab 3 diya gaya hai that is i am writing divisor equals to Divisor equals to I am taking sixteen. Okay, divisor equals to sixteen. Now I am taking quotient. Quotient equals to I am taking one hundred and twenty one. Then I am taking remainder. Remainder equals to I am taking chalo two. then what is our dividend we have to find out this dividend our question is what is our dividend so we know we know that dividend equals to i am writing di okay div dividend equals to we know divisor multiplied by quotient plus remainder we know this i am i have less place that's why i am writing in short but children you don't write short you write the full word okay acha mm, so what is the dividend we will find out we know divisor is given that is 16 so write down here 16 multiply quotient quotient is given what 121 so write here 121 plus remainder remainder is what 2 so write down 2 now we are what we are doing we will find the dividend now i am writing okay dividend equals to you will multiply this two in your rough place or in your fair also you can multiply this two number i am writing it will up 121 multiply by 16 you do 6 on the 6 6 to the 12 to 1 carry 6 on the 6 plus 1 7 multiply 1 2 1 6 2 plus 1 3 7 8 9 and 1 so what we got 1936 plus 2 so you will write plus 2 this so you can do orally 1936 plus 2 8 6 7 so this is our dividend so this is our dividend okay this way you can find out easily if divisor is given quotient is given and remainder is given you easily can find out the dividend very easy 
Okay, now the second one, next one. I will give you a sum when the you, you have to find out the quotient. Okay, let's see. That is also easy, not very difficult. Here in this sum, it is given a dividend. This is in your R.S. Agarwal's book. The sum is from R.S. Agarwal's book. I am solving this sum. You see that R.S. Agarwal's book number 7 exercise 3E. Number Sum number 7 I am telling you exercise 3E. This one I am solving. Okay. Uh, the dividend that is given dividend, dividend 5539055 five, five, then by 200 on dividing 55,390 by 299 means dividend is this by 299 means divisor. Our divisor is 299 and what they are saying? They are saying and the remainder is 75. Remainder is given. Remainder is given 75. They are asking find out the quotient. So, we will find out the quotient. We have to find out the quotient. Okay. This is our question. So, let us start. I am rubbing the question. I have the book. I, so, I am rubbing the question. Okay. So, for we know first you write down the division algorithm that is dividend. Why I am writing the division algorithm again, you will understand that div equals to divisor multiply the quotient plus remainder. Okay, this is our division algorithm. So, dividend they said that is 55,390. So, 55,390 is our dividend equals to divisor is 299. We do not know the quotient. We have to find out the quotient. So, and plus remainder they have given 75. So, we have written all this. Now, see carefully what I am doing. This is equals to sign. This is left hand side. This is right hand side. So, right hand side full thing. I am writing here in left hand side, okay. That is 2, sorry, 299 multiplied by Q means Q plus 75 equals to this left hand side I am writing here, full change. So, no sign will change, 55,390 5, I am writing here. Now, what I am doing that is 299 Q equals to 55,390. This 75 I will bring this side from left side to right side. So, it will become minus 75. So, let us do the minus 55390 minus 75. So, quickly do 10 minus 5, 5. 1, 1, 3, 5, 5. So, what we are getting? 299 Q equals to 55,315. This we are getting. After that, what we will do? We will simply find out the Q, find out the Q means quotient. So, quotient equals to 55,315 divided by 299. If you divide this, the answer you will get that is your quotient. So, still in our, if we will do the division and we'll, I will show you it is unnecessary all of you know, can do the division. So, you do the division and then you can find out the quotient. Clear? 
अच्छा roughly I am saying the quotient you will get you can see most probably it will come 185 you just see that okay you do the division simple division the division you do this way 299 and 55,315 simply you divide this most mostly it will come 185 you can also do all these long division orally if you can practice it properly okay so these are the two types i have shown you by which you can solve the sum based on division algorithm clear so today is this much all of you watch the full video and learn properly because this is very very important one and very frequently this comes in the exam for class 5 also 6 also this these types of sums comes okay so practice properly do the sum students and all the best for your exam and today is this much and bye bye